I'm Gina Mizell here with Connor Letourneau at the Valley Football Center in Corvallis where we thought we were coming to a press conference about the new makeover, the new renovations and expansion of this facility. We got that, but burying the lead a little bit, Oregon State suddenly has a new football coach. Minutes after this press conference ended, the new surface, and it's Gary Anderson, Wisconsin's head coach, uh, coming over to Corvallis, coming off a Big Ten West Championship, a 10-win season. Uh, this this is kind of like the Mike Riley uh, saga with him going to Nebraska. Nobody saw this coming. What's your immediate reaction to this hire? Phenomenal hire by Oregon State on a lot of different levels. Um, Gary Anderson brings a phenomenal defensive-minded pedigree with him. He's done well defensively everywhere he's been. He built up Utah State's program, got, brought them to an 11-2 record his last season there, and then in his two years at Wisconsin has had nothing but success. Uh, great running backs. Phenomenal defenses, uh, top 10 defenses both years he was, he was there. So really just a huge swing for the fences higher by Oregon State. I don't think fans could be any happier right now. Yeah, you, you sort of glossed over the running backs thing. Uh, Melvin Gordon may have heard of him. He's a Heisman finalist. He is at Wisconsin this year. So definitely kind of you can just tell he's going to bring a tough style to this, to this entire program. And it just kind of paint the picture of what this whole scene was like because it was crazy. Some, you know, the press conference happened. It was very formal. The, the coaching search was brought up by a couple of reporters and Bob DeCarolis and Ed Ray addressed it, but just kind of said, oh, the search is ongoing but then you know people kind of lingered back and we're talking to some folks and then we were getting ready to, to start writing about facilities and then all this news just just breaks all over the place right <laughs> I was talking to Mark Massari the associate athletic director about the coaching search and uh, the athletic director Bob DeCarolis comes up and looked pretty antsy and he said hey Mark you know we should go and Mark said one second and I could tell uh, Mr. DeCarolis really wanted to get going <laughs> and then about 30 seconds later you come up to me and you know, let me know that word is starting to surface. And then 30 seconds after that, we get the confirmation. And it was just kind of hysteria around here, everyone running around. And, uh, I don't, you know, obviously people in the program could not be happier right now. Yeah, I mean, even guys like players, like we talked to Jordan Billiman about not just the, the facilities upgrades that are going to be happening here, but just what the last week has been like for these guys that have sort of been left behind by Mike Riley. And, and uh, obviously he had no idea, and you said that he tweeted a couple minutes ago, like, oh, well, that was fast. So people even inside the program, I think, you know, the inner circle obviously knew this was going to happen, but um, this, this was just kind of a shocking uh, whole situation here. <laughs> over the last few minutes. <laughs> right, and also shocking because, you know, Gary Anderson has no known ties to Oregon mm -hmm. State. Obviously, uh, you, or Wisconsin has its own uh, pedigree, mm -hmm. and uh, you, it'd be hard to believe that Oregon State could uh, pay more than Wisconsin in terms of what they have to offer. So just a lot of surprising, really, all the way around. Yeah, absolutely. Well, he will be introduced on Friday afternoon at a press conference here in Corvallis, so we will be able to ask those types of questions on what lured him to Corvallis. And, uh, oh, yeah, he's going to have some new toys to play with here, not immediately, but by the 2016 season, Oregon State's going to have a new locker room, expanded training room, equipment stuff. There's going to be a concourse that connects both sides of Reeser Stadium, all kinds of stuff. So, but again, that's really not the big news of the day, but we will get to that uh, as, as the days move forward. So again, Gary Anderson, Wisconsin's coach, now coming to Oregon State and is going to lead the Beavers. So for Connor Letourneau, I'm Gina Mizell in Corvallis. We will catch you next time.